Okay, well, Dr. Stifler asked me to try something here to help me uh, understand what's going on here. Um, this is standard uh, SEC running uh, 27 LEDs right there. And uh, it's just a standard S SEC uh, exciter, SEC exciter, uh, with a 12 volt battery source. And what he asked me to do was make a little uh, antenna wand out of a coat hanger and connect it up to an earth ground, which is this earth ground going up the door into the backyard there and a stake. And he said, take it over to your SEC. Um, your LEDs and see if it has an effect when you get it near and look at that and the reason he had me do this is I'm insulated with a wooden rod here so I'm not doing this this is something else going on and this energy um, the way he's trying to explain it to me is not being pumped through by that little wire there it's it's a potential that is fed to that wire and then through oscillation it's exciting the environment around that receiver tower and lighting up these LEDs and when I get that antenna wire near that it's just like that plant and just like me it disrupts that and stops it and I set up another little experiment here to show I'm going to disconnect the earth ground right here I'm going to walk that tower a long long ways away from the transmitter tower and not in direct line with it to show you that what I found out today Let's see if I can do this and keep it going okay here we go for a little walk now this is on one long thin probably 36 gauge wire or something okay now I'm in the back area here so where I did another video and you can see those LEDs are still quite bright. And this is on this one little thin wire here and nothing else. And I've got the wand here in my hand and I'm just going to touch this like that and watch how this changes in brightness when I do that. Okay, that's with my thumb on it, that's with it off, my thumb on it, with it off. And I can turn it off completely if I touch the top here. There goes the whole thing. So what this tells me is this is doing something to the environment around that tower because I am nowhere near the transmitter. The transmitter is way, way, way over here on a long, 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 very thin wire right there. And um, that is a feeding out a potential, but the... RF or energy or whatever is being transmitted somehow all the way back in here to that light and like I say if I touch the tower here with my finger or something I'll shut it right off get near it I'll shut it off and then with this coat hanger here which I'll just insulate here I can change that environment and affect it let's show you how that works And so it, it, it has to do with this one little thin wire, but it has to also do with the environment that's around this, this receiver tower. And that coil, which is in oscillation, synchronized oscillation with the transmitter coil. And uh, like I say, this uh, blows my theory that the energy is just being pumped out through that one little wire. It, it isn't. There's something else going on here, and I'll leave that to the experts who understand radio theory and all that and quantum mechanics, but all I can say is this isn't anywhere near the transmitter. I mean, not even anywhere near, and it's going through walls and everything else, and it is still uh, still working. And that's probably 50 milliamps to get that kind of brightness out of a 12-volt source on 27 LEDs in series which would take about 81 volts to make that happen. Let me walk it back in and see if I can keep it on here. 
And in the daylight here, you can't see it very well. The uh, camera compensates. But uh, there it is, it's still on. I'll turn it off, show you how it turns off. There it goes on, off, on, off. And that's being fed by that one little thin wire. And the oscillation between a receiver coil and a transmitter coil and these little tower units here. But anyway, this is uh, really something that uh, I am struggling to try to understand how this all works. But all I can tell you folks is it does. You know, this, this thing is doing what the doctor says it does.